and the scaffold broke and four of us, like I said, four of us fell and we all got hurt. Luckily, nobody died. Joe Pernatus was working construction nine years ago when he fell and sustained serious injuries. Yeah, I'm hurting right now, you know, have trouble walking still. And Pernatus feels physical pain and joins others in feeling emotional pain for the lost lives of Arizona workers killed on the job. So I'm just grateful that we have the opportunity to, to take a minute and think about them and the sacrifices that they've given. 2012 data from the Bureau of Labor Statistics say there were 4,383 worker deaths in the nation. 37 of those were here in Arizona. That's less than 1%. But lawmakers like Representative Debbie McCune Davis says there's still progress to be made for protecting workers. We want to make sure that when we send somebody off to work in the morning, that they come back to us at the end of the day. That's why she helped push SB 1307 through the legislature. The bill requires employers to provide fall protection at construction sites at least six feet above the ground, a law that would help keep workers safe, something Pernatus is thankful for. It could have been even worse. The accident could have been worse if we didn't have the protections. And for those who couldn't be saved, Arizona remembers them. In Phoenix, Twilon Nugent, Cronkite News.